to T1's press conference. We'll start the uh, questions uh, from the outside media. Recording in progress. 그래서 저희가 나름 팀적으로 준비한 게좀 있었는데. 어 저희는 이제 이번에 좀 메타도 살짝 좀 해석을 좀 바꾸고 그다음에 이제 보시면 아시겠지만 역할적인 것좀 바뀐 게좀 있었거든요. 그래서 선수들이 이제 노력을 다 했지만 아무래도 결국 그 완벽히 만드는 과정에서는 좀 부족한 게 있었던 점 때문에 특히나 레비아 선수들이 오늘 이런 좋은 폼으로 경기했을 때좀그 부분이 좀 힘들었던 것 같습니다. 네. Then the second question is for Rossi. So I heard that you became close with some VCDCM players through rank games. So did you get a chance to meet some of them? And is there an interesting story behind? Uh, I'm a big, uh, me and YZ from Billy Billy, where we play ranked all the time. And then every time we stream together, it's really fun time. So I really enjoy playing with him. I did end up meeting him and Yosemite. And we went out to get yeah. hot pot. And that was a really fun time just hanging out with them. So yeah, I love them. And I love China. And I love... Yosemite and YZ a lot. Cool, thank you. Uh, this question is goes for X Ray. So first, commiseration on the last. And after taking the duty of IGL, it seems like there are lots of ups and downs in your whole team, but generally getting better and better. As you mentioned that, you are trying to adapt as web up the duty. So how is your IGL journey right now? Uh, yeah, I think I still have a lot of uh things to improve as an IGL because uh I don't have a really really uh much more experience in this game yet but uh but all of my teammates and coach helping me into the right direction. So yeah so so I think this needs some more time for me. Thank you. Okay well now uh transition to the online media Okay, first question goes to Sports Kida. Yes, uh, first of all, commiserations on the last days. My question is for Excurate. Uh, so, Master Shanghai was your first international event. I just wanted to know how your overall experience was and what, what are your biggest takeaways from this event? Yeah, I think for my first experience international in Shanghai, it's really good for me because we get a lot of things to learn and then also we get the chance to play against a uh, EU team and then Ameri North America team. I think it's really good because we uh, now we learn like the press style, the play style and then how we can uh, adjust in a real match, not in just a scrim. So I think it's really helpful for us. Thank you. Next question goes to Straff. Uh, this is to coach and anyone else who wants to answer. What were the biggest struggles during the event that you guys think uh, that you identified during the event that would help you eventually in the upcoming se upcoming rest of the season? Uh, I think our struggle right now it's um, maybe we should yeah maybe we need to make our map a much more bigger and at the same time also uh, working a lot of our mini game stuff on the match and improve our mechanic skill, that's all. Yeah, can I ask a follow-up question? Yeah? Uh, yes, please. Yeah. Uh, uh, obviously, it, it was a hard road for you guys where you qualified by a, like, by a slim margin. Uh, still, you qualified and it was your first international event as a team. Can you talk about the overall experience you guys have had as a team coming to the first international event? The experience was good. I mean, we like you said, we did qualify by a slim margin, but I mean, that's not to discredit like what we did. We did qualify and yeah. we did have good momentum coming into it. So, I mean, we did gain a lot of experience, to be honest. It should have been much differently for the first series. I should have done much better uh, with helping my teammates. So that, that was the only reason we lost. And then today, like, Leviathan played really, really well. So, the, I mean, 
that was just hard game. So we didn't give ourselves a really good chance, you know. So yeah, I mean, thank we did so learn much. a lot, and we will improve in the future. Yeah, thank you so much. Next question goes to uh, Guru News. Thanks. Uh, this is a question for the team. Um, unfortunately, you didn't have a good performance today against. Leviathan, what do you think was the hardest obstacle you faced today? Uh, 아무나 대답을 해주시면 되는데 오늘 경기에 있어서 레비아탄을 상대할 때 가장 까다로웠거나 힘들었던 부분이 뭐였나요? Yeah, okay. Let me answer it then. Uh, yeah, I think yeah, I think the struggle part. For now, it's just first. I think as a team, uh, yeah, especially we just keep losing on our map pick. This the we lost a lot of momentum there, and then also coming into the opponent pick. As you know, we don't have uh maybe much more time preparation for that map, and then basically we are my team is our team is like it's very hard for us to regain momentum when we lose the momentum. That's the hardest part that we need to overcome. Next question goes to Sense of Chaos. Hello, everyone. Thank you for the opportunity to ask a question. Uh, first of all, consideration on your loss. Uh, my question is for the coach Autumn. Uh, were there any specific strategies or tactics from Leviathan that cut you off guard? Uh, Leviathan is doing the strategies from 티원이 되게 많이 당황했거나 아니면은 좀 상대하기 까다로웠던 전략이 구체적으로 있을까요? 음 솔직히 어 스트레티지적으로는 막 이미 이 팀들이 여태까지 아메리칸 리그에서 많이 보여줬던 것들을 많이 쓰긴 해서 막 진짜 아 이게 뭐 새롭다라는 건 없긴 했고요. 네. 대신에 이제 졌던 이유 중에 하나가 그 워낙 선수들의 그게 좋았고 특히 이제 저희들도 이제 저희가 많이 좀 실수를 많이 했다 생각하거든요. 그래서 네, 그 갭만큼 졌다 생각합니다. Uh, no, uh, we had a lot of bots on what they were doing in America, so um, their strats specifically did not catch us off guard, but it was just that we were making mistakes today and the Leviathan, uh, Leviathan actually had a good day today. Thank you. Thank you. Do we have more questions in the room? I do have another question, if it's possible. Oh yeah, go ahead. Thank you. Uh, my question goes to Excurate. Uh, what do you think are the key points that you need to work with in order to perform better in an international stage? Uh, well, yeah, as I said before, the key point is first, we need to uh, make our map pool a bit wide, more wide. And then we're working on our mini games a fixing our mini games problem and communication and also just improve our mechanical skill that's all i think perfect thank you okay so this is a wrap for t1's press conference uh thank you everyone thank you good